Alright, I'm going to show all of you how to install TextPack from MCP 0.14.0. So first you got to go search Explorer. I'm going to have a link for it. You want to download this app called Explore File Manager. Alright, so you just got to install from the Google Play Store. Alright, so now the next app you want to install is ZipSigner. Again, on Google Play Store, I'll have a link in the description. Install it. Alright. So now you have installed the last app that you're going to have to install. It's called... Just look up app to APK. The one that I'm downloading is the f first one that pops up called APK Extractor. It has a lot of good reviews and everything, so that's why I chose it. You can download any one though. So just install it and then when it finishes to install, you can use, you can open it up. Alright. Just click install. Alright. So now you want to find a texture pack. That you're gonna use, alright? It's real simple, just go to mcpuniverse.com and look for a texture pack. I chose this one, which is called Blue, so I'm gonna download it, alright? And I'm gonna be back. Alright, so I'm gonna click the download link, it's gonna take you to a Mediafire link or AdFly, you just wanna go here and you wanna download it. Alright, so now that's done downloading, you can close out your Google Chrome, and now you gotta go to the app which is explore file now first you gotta go to app to apk so you want to go to app extractor or any other app that you could use it doesn't matter and you want to wait until it loads all the applications and you want to select minecraft pocket edition and make it an apk it's pretty easy to scroll down to the m's and you'll find it all right so I have a bit of apps, so it took a longer for me, it might be shorter, or even longer for you, it doesn't matter, so just mark a pocket edition. Alright, so now I'm going to go to the next part, which is in Explore File Manager. Alright, so here, you're in this file manager, which is my favorite, because it has two sides, which is the main design you get. So you want to go down here, you want to go to your um, extracted APKs file, and find Minecraft, you want to open it as zip, APK zip. That's the very bottom, after you hold down on it. Alright, so now you want to go into your other side, and you want to find your downloads for folder and find the texture pack that you downloaded. All right? It's going to be anywhere, and for me, it was right in my downloads folder, but you guys can make it down somewhere else, but not in the downloads for folder. So I found it. And now what you want to do is you want to find the thing that says either images or assets or anything like that. And you want to just copy images into the Minecraft Pocket Edition assets folder. You want to make sure when you do that, it says cop when you click copy. You want to make sure it says copy into assets. It says that's me. So then you want to click OK. And then after you click OK, you want to make it overwrite and you want to do that for all of them. Alright, so it's just going to do this real quick. And when it's done, you want to open up the other app, which is ZipSigner. Alright, I'll see you when I open it. So actually, before you open up ZipSigner, you want to uninstall Minecraft Pocket. So this won't delete any of your worlds. So don't be scared doing it. You just want to uninstall it. Because you have that APK which is going to reinstall. All your Minecraft words are always saved in the Minecraft folder so they won't be deleted. So now you want to open up Zip Signer. And you want to find the APK. So you click cruise in and out. And it's going to be an extracted APK. And that's the APK. So now you, the output file you can name it something else. So you can find it differently. I'm just going to name it. Might have pocket edition blue because that's the name of the text pack which I'm using. Alright, so I'm just gonna put that down and see. And you want to keep dot apk at the end. You have to keep that. Don't delete that. If you're changing its name. If you don't know what you're doing, I recommend not changing the name. But I did this a lot before, so I'm just gonna do this. And now you want to click sign file. Don't change the key mode. Sign file. And this is gonna take a bit, so I'm gonna skip to when it finishes. Alright, I'm honestly there. Alright, so it succeeded. So now what you want to do is open up any file manager, it doesn't matter now if it's explore, but I'm going to use explore because I personally like it a lot. Alright, so now you want to find is the folder where you saved your APK. It's normally the same one where you got it from, so in the extracted files folder, so I'm going to find that. Alright, it's right here. And I named it Minecraft Pocket Edition Blue, so I'm going to install it. And this one you want to make sure you have Minecraft Pockets installed already so you can reinstall it, except with the texture pack. Alright, so now I'm going to skip to when it finishes installing. 
Right, now I finished downloading it and installing it. And the reason I didn't show you like this setup to install it is because you can't do that because it's like that type of screen and wasn't recording. So I'm it crashed. It's always gonna crash on the first time when you add the skin. Always. I'm warning you guys right now. But you just wanna reopen it. And you'll see in the bit that I have a skin. When it finishes loading, so I'll skip it there. Alright, so um the skin the texture pack is here I mean. Alright, so as you can see everything looks a bit different, like there's the blue because this texture pack. It's just the one that changed everything to make it more blue, but you guys can download any ones they want. And I didn't play this in a while, but as you can see everything is blue now. And I'm just gonna play in one of my worlds. Alright. And you're gonna see how everything looks more blue. So this is gonna work for you guys no matter what texture pack you use. Um I recommend checking it out and all the links are gonna be in the description. Thanks for watching, it helped you guys, like the video, and if you guys want to see more, subscribe. And don't forget to check out my new channel, which is in the description. Alright, I post more there, so thanks for watching.